Hi, Hiram here. Yesterday I did a couple of videos on this stove that I got from 17HMR Sniper, a.k.a. Mike. That's a little bit easier to say. He sent me this stove that he calls the Axe Can Mini Stove, and I did a burn test and a quick boil test with it. But after I did those videos, I got a bunch of uh, comments from people and email saying that this is just way too small to use. It's just too wobbly. Even with the GSI cup, it's a little on the wobbly side because you have such a small base. Plus, with my putting it on this carbon felt, let alone trying to do it with something like my big Boy Scout pot. Look at that, it just rocks there. It's just too wobbly. Becker, Becker M13 had asked me, would the ever new titanium alcohol stove cross stand fit on this? And I thought, wow, cool, that might just be because of the way it's it's made here. This part you would think might fit in there, but unfortunately, no, it doesn't fit. And if you were to turn it over, then the pot would be t way too far away from the jets. So that just didn't work. Mike. 17 HMR sniper sent me a picture where he used this stove inside what he called a bushcraft essentials nano I tried looking that up but the only thing I could find was something called the bushcraft essentials outdoor pocket micro stove EDC box Wow what a mouthful looks like the same thing in the picture that he sent but the thing is only just a little bit wider than the stove is itself plus the additional stove weighs 75 grams so I'm not sure if that's a, a viable solution plus I think the the uh, stand costs like $22 or something like that and you got to get it shipped in from overseas so I don't know just didn't work for me so I've had a number of people ask me Hiram, what would you do if you were going to make a pot stand for this? Something simple. You know me. Like it simple. And this is what I was thinking of. It's something that will fit on the outside of the medicine bottle that the stove gets stored in. And all it is, let me just take this off here, is a piece of hardware cloth, the quarter inch square hardware cloth. It's seven squares tall. And this was just a scrap, so it might might be better to make it bigger. But in this case, it's 20 squares wide. This is just a quick and dirty to see if this will work. If this works, I would make it a little bit longer. And I would do my bit where I fold over the top and bottom rows to make it stronger and reinforced. But if you have it in this shape, it'll just go right over this, just like so. Brand those out. So it's more like a U-shape. One thing with this, this only weighs 4 grams or about 1.14 ounces for this thing. And price-wise, if you got this, this was just a piece of scrap from other pot stands that I made. Another thing, I just thought of it now, this won't restrict the uh, flames coming out. They're away from the pot stand is away from the burner on that other one the uh, nano it looks like the flames would be really restricted but just a quick little thing like this now here I have my Boy Scout pot it's got water in it and look at it that's pretty darn steady so let's see what happens here with the flames Another thing I was thinking of, to try to make this thing come to flame a little bit earlier, come to blossom rather, I just thought of maybe putting three or four drops of the alcohol on the carbon felt. Not much, just a couple of drops. To help prime it. Since you've got the carbon felt there anyway, you might as well put it to a use other than just insulating the stove okay so let me turn down the lights like that there we 
there we go we're lit in there like this side put this around now hopefully that'll bring it to a blossom a little bit earlier now you don't want to do a whole lot of alcohol here see there we go we're blossoming already room temperature is 46 degrees almost made it sometimes you gotta fan it a little bit to move those flames around maybe I could have put just a little more alcohol on the carbon fill come on there we go there we got a blossom now see how the pot stands not in the way of the blossoming let's put this on look at it from camera two that's pretty good look at that that's a nice flame it doesn't look like the pot stand is holding it up at all it's holding up the pot but not the flames they're out going across the bottom of the pot so really nice so boy I'm saying that a lot aren't I so 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 uh, so that's what I do little piece of hardware cloth quarter inch hardware cloth seven squares tall twenty squares wide just bend it in sort of a U shape you can wrap it around let's go back to the other camera you could wrap it around the bottle for storage just put it on with a rubber band and you've got everything in one little kit hmm. this might even get the water to a boil that's already warm not hot but it's warm okay so I hope that helps uh, for those of you that are looking at small stoves like this I thank 17 HMR sniper for sending this to me I thank you for watching I look forward to your input questions remarks helpful suggestions and as always watch for my buddy Max bye now